Hello to you, wherever you happen to be. Our action comes to you today from Villa Park. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Aston Villa versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea begins in goal. Harry Maguire plays with Victor Lindelof in central defence. And the front pair, Cristiano Ronaldo, starts together with Marcus Rashford. Rashford! Oh, and a wonderful stop. Offside, not that anyone knew. Given his magnificent form, then there's every reason to believe that Cristiano Ronaldo will make an impact here. Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations. And getting across to stop it. And over it comes. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort, a good strike from him. High pressing at its best. Won it back. And a throw in forthcoming. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Douglas Luiz. And he read it really well. Fine save. So the corner played into the box. And still dangerous. Well, threat over for now. Fred. Alex Tellez has it. Ronaldo. Had to come up with the ball and did. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Really good interception. Crossing possibilities. And a struggle to get it away properly. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Buendia. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Young. Well read to ease the pressure. Cristiano Ronaldo. A really sumptuous ball. Opportunity to take the lead. Nicely blocked. From the owner of the blue car, please return to your vehicle with the right time. Extremely sloppy in possession. Scott McTominay. Losing possession here. Douglas Luiz. Given away by Manchester United. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. Well, that's the kind of play you want from your defender. Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball, but they haven't done enough with it, particularly in the midfield areas, where their passing has been far too safe. And that needs to change quickly if they're to win this one. 
Ronaldo. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Playing advantage here. United keep it. And you need your defender to take charge. United regaining possession. And coolly done in the end. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. And the keeper diving to thwart him. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Not messing around with that clearance. Now they'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Really a very poor ball. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Who can they pick out? Well, thumped clear. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. We always like to assess how things are going for Cristiano Ronaldo. Stuart, a case of could do better. Well, he was slightly disappointed in that first half. He's had no real impact on the game. I just think he needs to work a bit harder to receive the ball. However, I'm sure he'll get better in the second 45. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Cristiano Ronaldo. Rashford. Well, negligent in front of goal. No two ways about that. Can they take advantage? Scott McTominay. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. They're trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Putting his body on the line. Ramsey has it. And he's in an offside position. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Bruno Fernandes. Well, it's been given away here by Ronaldo. Well, in the end, nothing really to worry the keeper about.
Bruno Fernandes. I must say, this looks promising. Dangerous ball. A really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. He's driven in the corner. And a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here's the replay. It's certainly a well-delivered ball into the area, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So on they go again, and that really should shake up United. Can they find a response now? And intercepted it. Well, as you can see, Villa are struggling to control possession, but what they've done with it has been really good, and they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter-attack. Good movement. And space to cross it. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Into the advanced position. Marcus Rashford in position. And it all counts for naught. And good pressure high up the pitch. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. Coming off the pitch, number 11, Ollie Watkins. Coming onto the pitch, number 20, Danny Ings. And now the delivery. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. A quarter of an hour remaining here. And a good-looking ball. He's in position. Can they keep it out? Marcus Rashford. Bruno Fernandes has it. Manchester United know they've got to get on the front foot with time. A oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping. Time is not on the side. This corner could help their prospects as they look for an equaliser. Substitution time it is here. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Corner kick played in. Well, he took care of it defensively. Edinson Cavani's in the vicinity. But he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Oh, he saved it! Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And he's clear his lines. Well, pressure building, another corner. <laughs> Playing it in. Not quite spot on with that one. Bruno Fernandes. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. 
Cavani. And a fine stop. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Cavani takes the shot. And how about that for a save? Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. The clock is against Manchester United here. But their dreams... And what a magical save it was! A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. Who can he pick out? The referee's whistle for full-time, and here's the big story. No points at all for Manchester United. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance. Well, Stewart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Yeah, he gave those defenders a difficult time. He got the all-important goal and created plenty of chances too. He certainly deserves the plaudits for his efforts today.